Bonnie, happy Thursday. I am back. Still cold weather. I love talking about the weather every day. That's like my thing now. I'm like, what's it doing outside? <laughs> We're supposed to get snow tonight, though. I cannot wait until April and May when we get those nice, like, 60, 70 degree temperatures. I want to go for a walk outside. My dog wants to walk outside. Poor Coco. Oh, by the way, I gotta move this over. It's driving me crazy. Um, I had a vase here. And I knocked my vase down. I broke it yesterday, and that's where my flowers were. But I got this big empty spot here. I gotta, I gotta redo my background a little bit, make it a little prettier. So, hey, what's happening today? You know what's happening today? It's Bath and Body Works is doing a buy one get one on Moxie. I'm like, what? They're, they're starting to do sales on Moxie. So I thought I would talk about Moxie today. Um, I've had like three months ago, I bought the Moxie Wavy Hair Conditioner with the Sunflower Extract. I finally used it. Um, you know, it wasn't terrible, but it was nothing to like write home about. I didn't love the scent. I didn't hate it. I mean, it was just like fairly like mediocre. Like, okay, it's conditioner. Like if this was at a hotel, I would use it. It would be fine. Um, but it was, like I said, nothing that I was like overly thrilled about. I am pretty set in my hair care routine. As many of you know, I use the Avon Elastine Pro Poly Thera products. Um, I talk about that on my other channel, Beauty Geek, but that's my hair care routine. I do kind of use a lush hair bar um, about once a week, but I am pretty set on hair care. So when Moxie showed up, I kind of debated. I'm like, which one do I want to try out? And they're saying it's online only, although I'm seeing it show up in some test stores. So I don't know if this is like something that's here to stay. I feel like it's a very odd product for Bath and Body Works. It's kind of like when McDonald's decided to sell pizza and everyone was like, what? We're not buying pizza at McDonald's. Um, Bath and Body Works does a really good job at what they do, which is body care, aromatherapy, even the wellness collection. I mean, True Blue Spa was so good. I don't know why they don't bring True Blue Spa back. Coco Shea, amazing. And it just like, that's the thing that like, I don't understand sometimes about like these companies is I know many, many people um, loved those collections, why they don't bring those back. Instead, we got this collection called Moxie, and it looks like what they did is they sent a bunch of boxes out to people via Influencer, which is, um, you know, something you can sign up for and get, you know, boxes in the mail. And they do have, they have hair care, skin care, dietary supplements, and I think those are the three products that they're doing. Um... Hair care, they have, they're supposed to have like a hair care for everyone. And they've got straight hair, coily hair, wavy hair, curly hair. So there's like four different, um, you know, product lines. I got the wavy hair one. Now, this is the fifth one. I think <laughs> there might be five. There's a lot of these. Are there, there, there's, no, there's four. Coily, straight, curly, wavy. And then for the big bottle, like the pint, it's like $28.95, which is pretty pricey. This is not like inexpensive shampoo. And it's hard to get people to sometimes like change over from what they've been using. Um, so to try it, it's kind of pricey. And then they also have like hair masks. They have facial products. They have a cleanser, a face mask a moisturizer, face cleaning milk for all different skin types. And then for some weird reason, they threw in dietary gummies. <laughs> I'm like, what? Honestly, like I take two vitamins. Like I take my Caltrate uh, vitamin D gummy. And then I actually just have like a one a day gummy. That's like what I take. I'm like, I'm not switching that around. I don't know. I've never been a huge fan of like, it's too confusing. This is like immunity support, stress report. I'm like, I just take one. Um, so that wasn't my thing. And it looks like they're getting like mixed reviews. Like 
from these boxes they sent out to people, um, some of them are really poor reviews. I mean, it's funny because like, here's the dry skin, um, facial moisturizer refill because they get a lot of refills they're trying to be like clean and green um fragrance free dermatologist tested not tested on animals vegan um and then like literally there was like a one star review and then there was a five star review for the same product so it's all over the place but i feel like the majority of the reviews are coming in um through influence store and like i said it's tough um I don't feel like I want to go and buy, even a buy one, get one free. I'm not going to buy all this stuff and review it because it doesn't feel like it's like on brand for Bath and Body Works for me. And you know me, I love my Bath and Body Works, but this just feels so, like such an odd, it's like the pizza at McDonald's. It's like, what the heck are they doing? So will it pick up? Um, maybe, maybe not. I don't know if it's a test. I don't know if they're trying to just like break into another genre to offer more shampoo because you know, Bath and Body Works, um, you know, occasionally they'll bring out like more shampoo. Um, the one year they had these really nice hair masks, actually, that was like, I think it was like part of the Coco Shea type of hair masks. They were really good. Um, I like the hair mist from Bath and Body Works. They'll do like a salt mist, sea salt mist. I like those. Um, when they did the wellness collection, which I don't know why that came and went, because a lot of people did like the wellness collection. Um, the blueberry, I like the blueberry extract, you know, but it was expensive. That was the only thing I didn't like about it. It was kind of pricey. Um, but this is just like, I'm not even sure what to say about this because I just feel like I'm talking about a completely different company, um, which is kind of odd. <laughs> so that's kind of what I got to say about Moxie. It is buy one, get one free today. I don't know if many people are going to try this. Um, I feel like they would have been better off if they just stuck with <laughs> having a sale on, um, you know, Bath and Body Works Body Care, which we all want. The only thing they got going on today is the Wallflowers are three ninety five, and um, the hand sanitizers are two ninety five. So I don't know, you guys. Let me know what you think of this uh, new Moxie sale. Have you tried it? Do you want to try it? Um, I don't know. I'm just curious to see what everyone thinks. I will be back later. I got some reviews for you guys. I will see you guys then. Bye bye.